Hello food lovers, welcome back to my kitchen. Today we will be diving into the world of flavors and colors with this delicious shrimp recipe. It is simple and easy to make, great as an appetizer or as a main dish. And so guys, wear your apron and let's get started. First, I will add salt to the shrimp with some water and I'm going to let it sit for 15 minutes. After soaking, I'll remove the shrimp from the salt water and rinse them under running water to remove any excess salt and dirt. Then we're now going to remove the head and the tail of the shrimp. This head and tail of the shrimp, I would advise that you don't throw it away. You can just compile them, put them in the freezer. Then when you have a large batch of this, you can grind it, shift it and use it to make a very delicious shrimp soup. So remove the shell on the shrimp. Using a very sharp knife, cut the outer area of the shrimp and wash out the intestines as you see me doing. After removing all the intestines from the shrimp, we are then going to pat the shrimp with a paper towel. For this recipe, we will be using 300 grams of shrimp. Using a cutting board, put all shrimp on the cutting board and we are now going to use our hand, our hands to smash these shrimps until they become mushy. We are now going to mince the shrimp. Shrimp has a better chewing texture when minced with a knife. Just give it a rough chop. In a bowl, we're going to put the shrimp in a bowl and add one egg white to it and give it a very good mix. While mixing, we're only going to mix to one direction. After mixing in one direction for one minute, we are now going to add some chicken seasoning to this. I'm adding one teaspoon and some black pepper. Give that a very good mix for one minute in one direction. And now to bind the shrimp together, we're going to add two tablespoons of corn flour and also continue mixing in one direction. All ingredients for this recipe will be in the description box. And I want to thank my subscribers for subscribing to my channel. Thank you guys. Thank you for your support. Seriously, I appreciate it. I love you guys for always returning to watch my videos and for your likes. Thank you. In a heated pan, we are now going to add a very little vegetable oil. After the oil has heated up to a certain degree, using a tablespoon, we are going to scoop up some of this shrimp into bowls and fry them on both sides for three minutes, turning the shrimps at intervals until they are golden brown. If you found this video very useful, please don't forget to smash the like button. Just smash it. It's in front of you. Thank you.
after they are golden brown try not to burn them put them remove them and put it on a paper towel and look at how beautiful and golden they are and now to make the sauce to go with our shrimp cake we will be frying some ginger and garlic until they are translucent and then I'm going to add some roughly blended habanero pepper and chili pepper together I added a teaspoon of chicken bouillon to this and a little water to this for it to cook and so we're going to allow this to cook for like three minutes and then our pepper sauce should be ready We are now going to drizzle this shrimp with some lemon juice. The lemon juice gives a rich and delicate flavor to this recipe. So it's a must that we must drizzle it with lemon juice. This shrimp recipe was so delicious. It went well with the pepper sauce. Guys, I overheat myself. My stomach was so overfull. Eh? Please try out this recipe. Comment in the description box. Let me know your thoughts on this video. Share with your friends and your family. And subscribe to this channel for more beautiful, delicious recipe like this. And thank you so much for watching my video thank you so much for your support i'll see you guys in my next video and cheers guys